All right, welcome everybody. This is the sixth video in uh, dealing with a series of building your website with Website Tonight, uh, the uh, template builder program. Um, in this video, I'm going to show you how to work with tables. And uh, so I'll go ahead and get started here. I grab a pen and a piece of paper. I always kind of say the same things at the beginning of each video, um, but uh, it just helps newer people learn, you know, the process. So. Um, on your piece of paper, write down this address, www.theletteru and then savedomains.com. We've got five prior videos to this one, so you'll want to watch those, and those are located lower down in the tutorial section off our homepage. Now, again, uh, to build your own website, the templated program, uh, you don't have to have any cust uh, experience building websites, so it's ideal for those people that don't know how but want to build their own site for their business or for personal reasons and you need the domain name here you can register one right there and then you also need a website builder program located right here but I'm gonna go ahead and get started um, I'm gonna log into my account and then remember on the left side we've got to click on website tonight it's gonna move around a little bit we'll scroll over here on the right side under my products website tonight and I'm gonna click launch here it comes and remember when you first go in you're gonna to want to click on the little thumbnail here now this is only for the people that have watched the five prior videos if you haven't yet you'll need to do so so I'm gonna open up my designer section and here's my real estate template that we've built out on the prior five videos remember you have hundreds and hundreds of templates to choose from on various categories so I'm gonna work with uh, tables let's say for example I want to add a small table in my body here so I'm gonna click in the body now it becomes an editable region I'm gonna put my cursor where I want it and let's say I want to center that move this over a little bit here I go up into my fonts area and I go to the alignment section and now you'll see my cursors right there in the middle so let's say I want to add a table there I'm going to click on the insert tab right up here and I'm going to go to tables it's going to ask me the dimensions that I want for my table and I'm going to choose let's say I want two rows by two columns I'm going to click OK here's my table sitting right there now if you want to modify it you need to basically click directly on the table let's see here there we go you double click on it here come the uh, property section alright let's see here T -t 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 table properties alignment I want to center it I got my cell spacing my border thickness let's say I want to make that really thick I'll choose a four. I have all sorts of other options up here, but just for the sake of making it quick, I've, I've centered it and I've made the border of it thick. So you'll see there that here's my table. And right now it's in the middle. So what I can do next is I can add, I can click in any of these boxes and I can type in what I want. I can also add images to these boxes by going up here to insert go to my images section and I can add those in there I've showed you how to add images in the prior video so I won't go through that again with you but that's how you work with tables remember if you ever need to edit it just double click on it and here comes the uh, editable section the property section of the tables and that's how you do tables over at usavedomains.com in working with our website builder program. Alright, thank you and please visit us to watch the other videos. Thank you. Bye-bye.